guys, it's Twisted Auto Garage here, another video. Today I don't want to talk about replacing your bearings and your go-kart wheels. Uh, and this, this is just more general information. You can use it for go-karts or anything you really have. So this one had bearings in it, but I knocked them out earlier because they came in three-fourths. Uh, usually when you have go-karts, they'll either come in uh, three-fourths, five-eighths, or sometimes an inch. Um, but you would replace it just because they're gunked up and um, or the wrong size. But what you're going to want to do is get your a hammer and a rod of some sort and get a vise or some somewhere to lock down the rim. And you want to make sure that there's space underneath there for the bearing to fall out. Uh, on this one, I usually just knock them out on a basket with some holes on the other side to, to apply pressure on each side but for this one I'll show you using a vise. So you're going to want to put the rod in at an angle to apply pressure on the bottom bearing. So I'm going to come in at an angle there and you're going to give it a few taps on top with the hammer. And you will fall in the hole sometimes. or a lot of times, but you want to periodically check it and you'll see that it comes a little loose off one side or loose on the other and it eventually after you know a couple thousand taps you'll knock them out. You can use a, a WD-40 or any other penetrating oil if it just ends up getting stuck in there. Um, for instance using an older one. Um, they may just break completely when you try this method. So this is just an easy, simple way to get out some cheap bearings. All right, guys, so after you know a million and one hits, uh, you do get the bearing out. And after you get the first bearing out, you can move up to maybe a bigger bolt or just a big, you know, large piece of metal that, will, that can slide into that hole to knock the bearing out. And so what you're gonna wanna do for here is, um, you don't want to damage your bearing just by beating on it with a hammer. You just kind of want to slide it into place and then apply something that will cover the whole area including the rim of the bearing with a large piece of metal and just beat, beat your way down into there. And of course you won't you could damage your bearings this way, um, but if you know what you're doing and you've done this a few times, you won't have any issue. And you just want to get it where it's nice and flush into the tire. Uh, you can see I, I just need to beat it in just a little bit more and it will be nice and flush all the way around. But anyway, I hope this helps and I hope um, that this saves you a little bit of money and headache. So to wrap this up, get a vise, get a hammer, get some, something to smash it with, and a rod and you can replace your go-kart bearings, whatever bearings you want to replace with that method. So thanks for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.